We first met Christo through a contact with our commercialisation arm within the university. And it started off as a simple discussion to try and understand some of the challenges that Christo was facing and some of the capabilities we had here at Flinders for developing new materials and new processes. Um, we had a number of discussions with him and we uh, decided to uh, get him involved in the Nano Connect program. That program is all about uh, introducing companies to nanotechnology and exploring some of the ideas and, and options that there are to produce new products or, or solve production problems. Through this process, we're able to create a new material called Borsalite. Borsalite's an ideal material for this type of product and for Christo. It's lightweight, it's strong, and because of the way it's manufactured, we can actually do it in the types of volumes and the batches which are consistent with a precision watch company such as Borsell. For researchers, there's, there's big advantages in working with industry. We get to understand the, the real world problems that are out there, and industry equally get the advantage of having access to a lot of technology and, and knowledge that they may not normally be aware of. I never thought I'd uh, be working on a high quality watch and having it displayed at, uh, at Basel World, but that's, I guess that's the, the interesting thing with nanotechnology, that it's very pervasive and it really applies to all sorts of different industries and different products. This is potentially a really exciting opportunity for Australia. By being able to manufacture in Australia, we can actually ensure the quality of the entire product. It will truly become an Australian product and we can form an Australian company to actually do the manufacturing.